Totally zoom, we'll come back some more Fire Emblem Three Houses. So, uh, yeah, let's just, yeah, we've already did the battle preps for this episode, so let's get into this. Yeah, it's gonna be, uh... Look Wait, there. oh, Demonic okay, beasts. we got this battle. I, I, I kind of forgot which back. one we got. <laughs> I don't blame you, it's been a while. Like, how many, how long has it been? Yeah, but it's understandable. We, I had a bunch of night shifts that Hello, came out of nowhere, and the Welcome only time I was available, it was like basically all I could do was Mario Party or Family Feud. My name is Kanya. <laughs> this weakling girl was just a borrowed. Oh God, and people on your side, you've got a bunch of Alex Crystal <laughs> episodes and helping really that like. one guy Alucard now, out with stuff, for probably. Me. I'll take yeah. down every last one of you. Oh uh, yeah, this this. Monica's evolved to Cronia in battle, like a Pokemon or something. Yeah, I can't wait to see uh, her in uh, Three Hopes. Speaking of, I don't think did Stay I ever focused. get you thoughts on that, by the way. Um, I don't think we had a video talking about it, so we'll just do it here. I am the Ferdinand first Fire Emblem Warriors, it was I liked it. It wasn't the best. I found Hyrule Warriors to be better and Age of Calamity, but. This looks like it's going to fix a lot of the polish, you know, like, make it better than That's what we had, because I guess a reason why not many people like Fire Emblem Warriors was they were expecting so much more of Fire Emblem than I'm on we it. only had just, what's the best way of saying it, uh, just the tip of the iceberg oh, yeah. of mm -hmm. the entire series. Mm -hmm. And also, I mean, I gotta say, though, the sun. I wanted a new Fire Emblem game, not another Warriors game. Like seriously, so I many people. Wish. I've seen like compilation videos of like people going like, "Oh my god, yes!" And then they go, and then they flash the Warriors to go, but we went, "Wait, wait, what?" <laughs> my gosh, I'm just happy that you know, because Fire Emblem Warriors Three Hopes looks like it will be a good little side story because people were always complaining about there's no gold in Round Three Houses. But in my opinion, not every game needs a prevail. golden route. Oh, the game that me and Alex are playing, Triangle Strategy, apparently has a golden route. Oh my gosh. No, like, a real-life version oh, of me. a golden route would be like someone holding up the Confederate flag and the U.S. flag. Like, they're dressed up as a Union soldier from Civil War while also dressed up as a confederate soldier at the same time. We're gonna work together to save America. Like, it's just not gonna Hold happen. Hold up. Now's our chance. This golden route does not make any sense. Okay, that it's happens. Just, like, I can't be, like, golden routes sometimes just don't work out in a video game. It's like, Fire Emblem Fates is golden oh, route. Oh, about oh, how Fates' oh, story was stupid. Oh my god. And then Rebel makes it said hold my beer. <laughs> oh my god. I have to say that the story of War at the first Warriors game was just so bad though. I didn't even notice it because I was the guy who just skipped all the cutscenes oh, to get straight you, to the gameplay. Oh then you're lucky then. <laughs> I'm gonna make a guess and say it was like what's the best way of saying it? You it wanna was know how bad very you know. of a story. No, here's the I thing, Xander is actually the is actually the that's how bad it is. Gosh. Considering how stupid he is in his own game. Yes, he's better in, in a spin-off game than he is in his own game. That well, is sometimes, impressive. you know what they say, a broken clock is right twice a day. We just found that one time zone where he's right. <laughs> we have I mean, oh my god. I mean, I'm you looking plan. forward to Warriors, but I don't know if I'm going to do a less plan. Probably not. I wanted to do an original, I wanted to do the um, actual Warriors game with like Alex or Crystal, but the thing is, so the game doesn't have online play. Which is a shame. Hopefully they will learn with this one. But then again, I don't think it was, it wasn't until Dynasty Warriors 8, for example, that the Dynasty Warriors series had online play. Yeah, and we've seen how good Nintendo is with internet, so... <laughs> And also, you know, the, the Dynasty, the Muso are Warriors no, team developers, their history with it. So I'll just, from what I've seen, the Warriors games are best played as a, oh, I just got off of work, I'll just, uh, go on and you know, they're almost like, they're more, they're almost like, they're more advanced button mashers. No, there's nothing wrong with button mashing, it's just, you know, you have to do it right. Yeah. Like for me, Dynasty Warriors. I mean, they're not like beat em ups either. You know, 
if you think about it, those hack and slash games like Dynasty Warriors are kind of an advanced version of beat 'em ups. Because you're beating people up, but you're using weapons and all that on a 3D plane instead of a 2D. Mm -hmm. but, you know, that would be funny, a Dynasty Warriors game, but it uses Streets of Rage and other Sega characters. Back in Sonic the Hedgehog, just killing everyone. Streets of, of Rage 5 right there. Yeah, right there. Right here. Random up! Random up! And then, of course, there's the the Yakuza all. guys, because Yakuza basically is the only series that Sega uses, like, they care for besides Sonic. And they don't even care for Sonic that much. Yeah, like, it's it's either, like, they even make money on Sonic, Valkyria Chronicles, or Yakuza recently. I don't even think they make money off of Valkyria Chronicles anymore. Well, it's been a while since the last one, came out, right? Yeah. And then right, for there you go. That's what Streets of Rage 4, they, had, they just outsourced it because they were like, yeah, whatever, do what you want. Same thing with uh, that Panther Dragoon remake that I played and thought it was decent. Yeah, people didn't like it. They thought they could have been better, though. Oh, yeah, I can see why, but like the, the patches aiming, and updates fixed reticle? a lot of the like, issues. Like the aiming reticle, like, why is it in front of the dragon? Like, I never got that. Yeah, that's... what's the best way of saying it? They didn't think it through. Mm-hmm. That's what I mean, like, it could have been better. But, back to the, uh, Three Hopes. Another thing I like is with the characters got different looks. Oh yeah, that I really love. Yeah, Have you I... seen Lorenz? Oh my god. Yeah. I know Hilda looks stronger than different, I look, almost yeah. like she's trying to look like Ingrid in time skip. Mm -hmm. Oh god, I'm not looking forward to seeing how Ingrid looks actually. <laughs> she looks 70 now. Oh my god, like how could you have made her look worse? I think. The, the... He really looks really cool though, I have to say I like his look. Yeah, and of course, once again, of, you know, Claude is the best looking one of everyone. Oh, yeah. Of the like, have, you seen, have you seen the Deuce Time Skip portrait? He looks, he actually has a beard now. I know, he's like, kind of reminds me of uh, one of those dwarfs at uh, Dragon's Crown. Oh, sorry, kind of. Like, like, there is, like, when you could play the different players in, Dra in Dragon's Crown as a dwarf. Mm hmm. Different alternate attires. It kind of reminded me of one of those. Yeah, and actually, did you notice? Did you see Hilda's brother actually? I think it's. I don't well, remember seeing Hilda's brother. I'll have to look at it again. It's but... in the new, newest trail that actually dropped. Uh, yeah, I'd have to see it then. Yeah, we actually get to see Holst actually. Not in, not in the actual game, but we get to see it in Warriors. That is sad. Well, hey, we can finally stop uh, speculating. <laughs> I'll just tell it for you right now, he actually has pink hair. Oh, fucking course he does. Everyone predicted that. What we just imagine, heck? like, freaking Arnold Schwarzenegger from the Terminator with I pink hair. That's how we all imagined him to look. <laughs> yeah, and actually, we get to see Caspar's father, too. Oh, yeah, that guy. Let me guess, he's, just, he's a little munchkin. Uh, no, actually, he's actually tall and buff. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Don't you love it when they do something like that in media, where it's like... Can we see his... And now, if only we... Oh my god, can we actually see his brother? I mean, we get to see Randolph. Maybe. Oh. Oh my. Oh god, this is not good. Uh, Caspar, please. Let me you can this guy, please. Nope, that is not a cat. Okay. Uh, but, but yeah, with uh, some other stuff, I was checking out some of these. This one guy who's had some written short reviews for a bunch of FE hacks, oh, yeah. and then I saw that he was going through a little play of the one that was kind of infamous back in the, the day called Devil Decay of, of the Fangs. Oh, wait, what was it called? Damn it. I'm trying to remember, what was it? The Devil... I, I, it, what was it that you told me his name is? Decay of the Fangs. Oh, Decay of the Fangs. Because it was like originally oh, incomplete, and all of a sudden, oh, by the way, it's finished now, and we're going through it, and my god, it's... Uh, some of the sprites do, like, you know, the portraits do not look good, and then I managed to find a tier list of what you would rank them. Must plays, Order the Crimson Arm is up there at must plays. Requiem, which we kind of did My not do a good, good review on for, it's in good slash worth playing. Justice of Pride also, Last Promise, the yes. 
he gives no some good fair reviews for them. Oh, wait, and then, so he, wait, he actually made an actual, like, like... Review for them? Yeah. It's a written review that I managed to copy-paste. So Black Promise was the first complete original FE hack, and is thus one of the most well-known and impressive hacks. You play as three different lords through an infamously bad story. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, I was about to say... Uh, yeah, the Kellic doing the magic thing. Yeah, that was fucking stupid. <laughs> the maps and balance, are, ba and balance are inconsistent, which is true. But it's still decent and polished enough to be worth a playthrough. Hey, I, played the, I would rather play those games than, you know, um, FE4, actually. Really? Yes. Probably yeah. because FE4 is just too vast of a level. Oh my god, me and Aunt Chris are going through Chapter 2 right now. Kill me, please. <laughs> wait, chapter 2? Yes. Wait, oh wait. Oh, the disturbance and the gust. Yeah, I can understand that. Yes, chapter and we spent has too five much hours on it. We've been spending five hours. If it makes you feel better, the next chapter, Lion King Eldigan, or El yeah, Eldigan, much better in terms of not trying to make you backtrack so much. Yeah, but... Uh, and then the chapter after that... It's... Uh, yeah, you have to go around the mountain. And yeah, it's around. so stupid. Yeah, it's... Looking back, some of the FE4 maps... I understand, you know, vastness is cool and all that, so. but, uh... I think the reason why the maps are like the way they are is basically for sure, but this is a bit too much. <laughs> Yeah, a little too much. But, uh... Right, back to the tier list, you're saying. Yeah, then he has gimmick hacks, where they're, like, based on a gimmick, like Iron Emblem, which is a 21-chapter-long hack that lets you play as generic faceless units. What generic? How would you want to play a oh, hack like, like that? That's why it's a gimmick. Yeah, but, it's, yeah, but like, what's the point? Of, but the whole point of, like, playing Fire Emblem is basically for, like, the characters. Yeah, but that's the joke. That's why it's a gimmick. He's got one just called An up. Attempt Was Made, featuring Matthew's Nightmare, which was one of those rage hacks that you could just play in 10 minutes. Oh, okay. And okay. He has only one for a tier called You Didn't Even Try, called Two Princesses, which was a Japanese hack that got translated. It supposedly takes thousands of years after Radiant Dawn, and it basically just, that's the Admiration. end of the originality. After that, it's just... A thousand years after Radiant Dawn? Uh, like, thousands. Thousands? And then it's just like, after that, it's just basically Sacred Stone. Oh, <laughs> okay. FB8. <laughs> Yeah, then of course he's got, for palette swaps, the famous one, of course, is Dorcas Emblem, where yeah, everything is FE7, but everything is Dorcas related. Oh my god. And some of the characters, if that. it's like the Sarah, yeah, that's why it's called We get palette. it, it's a gimmick, we get it, Dorcas, okay, just stop. But then, we get to where the really bad FE hacks come in. We're not the bad ones yet. Oh no, here is where it well comes in. The first tier, the, the tolerable tier of bad FE hacks. Cringe Kino. A uh, Kino is supposed to be like masterful cinematography, like say Seven Samurai, like that type of level of cinematography. They call it Kino, it's like a slang term. Oh, okay. So you call it cringe and then Kino, so it's cringy, but it's masterful and it's cringe. The first choice he has here is the Fire Emblem poop, which is just basically someone made a YouTube poop FE hack, where the main lord is CDI Link. I owe you one. And of course, you get various characters such as Michael Rosen, Tommy Wiseau from The Room, and it's like, where this hack fails is the gameplay. The maps are either way too long, way too short, or have random, overpowered enemies out of nowhere. Your recruitables are either stupidly good or completely worthless. <laughs> what? Oh, wow. I mean, that, 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 that sounds like epic. Caution is needed. <laughs> Wait, what? No. Are you kidding me? Like, most of the epic six are just bad. Oh, what about Percival? I'm sorry. Uh, I said most, okay. Okay. Then he's got Code of the Burger King, a long-running Fire Emblem joke that is taken to its extreme, because Black Knight 
His, his initials are BK. I know, yeah. What? Yeah, yeah, that one. The main enemy is Ronald McDonald, so that's all you Marvel need. Marvel our strategy. Then the next tier oh, is just no, I can see why you said this is a shitty tier. Now, the next tier below that. What? This tier is there below is that? Yes, there are worse. This tier right underneath it is called Mage Knight 404. Oh, God. There's only one entry, and you know which one it is. <laughs> yeah, I want. I can. I can take a guess though. <laughs> All right, then after that, we get something called Absolute Train Wrecks. The first one, Black Dragon. Oh, that doesn't sound too bad. All right. Review. Written by a 30-year-old autist who thinks he's God's gift to hacking. Okay. It badly attempts. <laughs> It badly attempts to replicate the mood and environment of worlds like Game of Thrones or The Witcher. Terrible courtly dialogue. The main lord is just an edgy teenager's attempt at brooding loners. And then there's the casual references to various graphic details, which were later on removed in updates after several complaints. Yeah, that's not good. Not when you have to literally update the game to get rid of stuff that people are saying, get this shit off the screen. It just sounds like someone's first attempt at trying to be edgy. Next up, oh, Inheritance. So yeah. Oh, you're gonna love the first one. He's a terribly written hack starring a bunch of absolute morons. After about five chapters, some dark elements get introduced, and it seems like you might need to play as the villain. But no. After showing them off, you then just get out, get to take over the boring protagonist. Again. This is a pair. Wait, why did you broke up there? Hello? Hello? Oh dear, not again. Yeah, yeah there you go. You broke up for oh. a second there. You said you cut out okay. after reporting for Pagan. Okay, um let's see. But yeah, <laughs> it's fine. just basically just a waste of time. Then there's a tier underneath that that's bad called absolute cancer. First Did you make this tier list? I, I don't, you never told me actually. No, this was some guy I found that saw on the internet that does these hacks. He does them like... Oh, wow, this is basically like me, back in my early days, okay. Yeah, but the problem I is, like, he picture. doesn't do video, he just... He writes them down with little highlights of some of the screenshots and all of that. But my gosh, there are some really bad ones that you And, uh, pride. this tier, Absolute You're Cancer. You're making me look bad. Geb emblem. That's oh, all we God. need to know. No, no, stop. Just stop. That's all we need. And then the second one, Duo Gino Escapo. That's all I've got to say, because it's just really stupid. And then the last tier, which is basically it should not be on the internet. It's called Resurrection. That's all we need to know. Seriously? Oh. And Resurrection is spelt with a Z. Oh not no, an S. stop, stop. The cringe already. Yes. And to make things better, apparently the guy who made this hat oh, that everyone's yeah. trying to forget ever existed, he's blacklisted from many Fire Emblem communities. What? <laughs> He is either that big of an asshole, or his hack is that fucking bad. Yeah. No, fuck. So whatever oh you like, your, like, say, if you did like how the EMEs that you had turn out, be glad you never got to get levels. But yeah, those are the ones you would, I, I would not recommend, ever. Well, I will definitely not, you know, watch... Unless, of course, you want to... Torture yourself. No. Like, say, just huh? in pride hard mode. That we had to end that because unfortunately me? we couldn't beat it. Prepare yourself for death. Wait, just in pride hard mode. What are you talking about? Stay focused. 
Oh my god, the score. Alright, well, windsuit can do the job. Can I do this with Wait, So are the crew. There is it. There it is. You're a fool to be so brazen. Uh. You'll never avenge your father at this rate. <laughs> oh, well, at least she comes to you to make it easier. With my own hands. Crit. No. Okay, press no. it. Can't wait to kill this person. I am Ferdinand von Eyre. Oh god, I can't wait for us to get to this next one. <laughs> can I please... Uh... Critter! No! Alright, well, I killed him. Level up? No, okay. Close though. Oh, wait, we gotta watch this cutscene. <laughs> oh, yes, the classic. I love this. <laughs> how do you roll that far? But how? Here. How could I really lose to a lonely creature like you? Because I'm an avatar. My plot powers is a lot better. Well. Solon, don't just stand there and stare. I need your help. Yes, you Look most that certainly head. do. Huh? It's too big to be a forehead. <laughs> Kill him. Why are you just standing there? Have no fear, Kranya. Your sacrifice will help to rid this world of the filthy vermin that have long infested it. Kill him! Why are you just standing there? I want to see what's going on! <laughs> I gotta say though, the audio for this, if there was no context, just not sound good. <laughs> oh my. Like, <laughs> this line that's coming up right here, without context, imagine. Imagine. The time is finally come to unleash the forbidden spell of Zaharas upon our enemies. And then how Kranya falls. <laughs> Please. Thank you. And she's dead. <laughs> Why would I help you? You stupid, stupid jerk. You killed my dad and you expect mercy? If you wanted mercy, seek religion. <laughs> Quoted <laughs> by Lith. Be gone with you, Felstar. So where is the rest of the class? Um, they're taking care of one of those giant monsters on the other side of the map at the moment. Oh yeah, I gotta... That could yeah, only oh. have been magic. What yeah, we, we didn't professor? think this strategy through, though, did we? They were swallowed by the mystical darkness of the forbidden Kill him! Why, kill, why are you all standing there? In a void of Where are your weapons? I tell you martial arts. Like, come on. To think, we almost had the sword of the creator. You're lying! Our professor is alive, I know it! That's right! It is hard to fathom that our professor would die in a place like this. It is possible that death has yet to find your friend, but there are worse things than death. Drifting through the darkness with no chance of escape, overwhelmed with hopelessness. <laughs> it must be torturous. You're already boasting a victory, but know this. If you did use such devious tricks to stop our professor, I you swear truly you win. will regret me, 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 me. I cannot help but agree you with you this once. Even if our professor is trapped in darkness, it matters how they win as long as they win. That is not the end of their story. I will not forgive such arrogance. If you prefer it so, you shall also be added to the ranks of the dead. Okay. You fool! What were you thinking, charging right into an enemy's trap? Are you just a boulder that rolls down whatever hill it's on? No, even a boulder has more sense. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, I can explain. Like that SpongeBob right. episode with this that guy. Where he's just in like a little, like eight-year-old clothing. Uh, I can explain. I too am trapped within this void. <laughs> But please That's how I imagine this. it to be done. This realm of darkness we are in is separate from the world from which you came. In time, our hearts and minds will cease to be. 
Are you prepared to die? Yes. <laughs> yes. How very brave of you to joke at times like this. Is that was joke? <sighs> there is no other choice. I must join Smash. <laughs> My choice. Uh, Please. Do you recall your Damn father's it. If I join Super Smash Brothers. What are you waiting for? You said you were a child who never cried. No so the power to choice. I think I am the one to blame. My gosh, that trailer. I must have been a. I never was so bummed. I feel for I was Smash a Brother of trailers you. since that one. I do not know it's how like they managed it. Why was join the house Smash? I love that tagline. <laughs> The truth is, I have always been with yeah, you. Because I remember it seeing this, like the trailer live on the stream, and this like viewer count just the dropped. Power of the goddess. <laughs> Wait, seriously? The power of the That's what I recall. But then again, it's been a long time. Like, what was it, like 2019? My name uh, 20, it was this. Early oh, 2020. Now you must be well oh, okay. aware of what that means. It was just still a freaking funny I am trailer. The one who watches over and it's just like, and the I can't believe they've done this. I mean, I'm not I surprised. I mean, you know, it was a live stream she dedicated to a specific character. And what characters get announced a lot during, you know, Smash Bros. live streams? Fire them characters. <laughs> yeah, it's like, you think when they said from series that There's haven't like been in the game that they wouldn't get something return. like this. I mean, it wasn't a third party character. I mean, we got God. Joker, Banjo Kazooie, Hero, we got oh, Terry Bogart. You had to accept we were going to get done so in there. I must relinquish all the power that I have. Yeah, I, if I was expecting a you. Nintendo one to be in there, I'd expect one that come. wasn't you in Smash yet. Join as one. But Fire and Emblem has had pass, a history of being in Smash at this point. Excuse like, me, how many are we up to out now? Like eight, I think? Too many. My gosh. Too many. When I say disappear, I do not mean that all I am will be no more. My soul will join. Okay. And we have another cutscene. <laughs> right after. Your will and mine. You could put that one. one famous song from Kingdom Hearts Both over this, and it will probably fit. You know which you one I mean? Uh, fragments of memory or. Like the one that was at the Smash what trailer. Shall you do? Oh yeah. Oh okay. Yeah, that actually, when they here. yeah, like this part. Yeah, it would fit so well here. Okay, thank God. <laughs> I don't oh, want the FBI boy. knocking on my door. FBI, open up. We heard you said some mean things on the internet. You can't allow that. <laughs> so the power to so join the I can't. I can't. I live. All right, now let's just bomb rush this guy and get it out of here. Professor. Oh wait, I didn't kill right. the monster. Oh I god, that's that not good. Always come back to us. Don't worry, you just can't believe in yourself or some shit like that. What did you see in the darkness? I'm sure that's how it works. All right, so Madison's not here, and I have a uh, green hair now, and I have the sublime fear sword, which is pretty good. Just use your final smash, problem solved. Wait, it, uh, oh, yeah, what was the fun? Okay, I have not played Smash in a while. Here's Zolan. You basically you summon a JPEG of oh, uh, right. <laughs> of of so this. so this. I forgot about that. And then you just hit a massive attack with like your sword, I think. And then everyone flies and they die. Mm -hmm. I've been playing a lot. Of, I've been playing with Sora recently, so that's why I forgot about violence. Yes, Bylus was pretty underwhelming in my opinion. Oh come on, it's not the character is not that bad. I'm not talking about that. I'm just saying like of all the things you could have done, you use a fucking JPEG. So do I not have? Oh my god, do I not? Oh, that is not helpful. okay. How am I gonna? Oh. And then of course it's like, oh, I wonder what wave two is. Min Min. If I recall, Min Min is like one of the most 
unplayed characters in Smash Brothers Ultimate? Uh, yeah, I think so. I mean, like, people were happy about her, but like now people just don't care. <laughs> I don't remember anyone being happy. Then again, if I if I recall, like there was like a uh, okay, I guess. I think it's because like you know, like arms like just it, it wasn't like it received as well as like you know. That was nothing. Some of the other Nintendo IPs up to yeah. Oh my god, nice job. And again, it was still like one of those that keeps updating to have more content as the game lives. Yeah, I like Splatoon. Wish. Like Splatoon. Yeah, the. If I. This is kind of. Yeah. I'm curious, like, what's the most played characters for Smash Brothers? Uh, I'm pretty sure, like, they might. Uh, I don't know, probably, I mean, the answer would definitely, like, shock you, I mean. But, I mean, I, I don't know, though. Yeah, I know that they have, oh, well, here's a list for, like, the I'm major tournaments. It. Oh, great. But the thing is, do we count tournaments? Together, we can't again, no. that's, like, a major part of it. No, I don't We got this it. one where people have actually put in surveys and... Okay, here we go. Well, then that's fan-based. That's not actually, like, real. Those aren't, like, accurate answers. You can't go I will get the victory. Well, it's the closest we got. Uh, no. I can think of it very sources. Okay, what, what... Where should I check it? Uh, maybe you can just Google the answer. I created a plan. Go to Reddit. They're, they're always right. Like, oh. These two things I found were what I... Don't tell me you got them off the road, please. I know you're gonna. Be oh no no no! You know I don't do Reddit. Uh huh. Yeah, sure. The like the last time I went on Reddit is to lurk to find an answer. That's basically it. <laughs> Wait, what? All right, here we go. Apparently, four characters are not like have barely any presence in the Smash Brothers tournament scene. These four are. Sephiroth, There's Tyra. Then I, I guess it's because Sephiroth is like, like there haven't been any major Smash Ultimate tournaments since Sephiroth. Because it shows like basically two people out of all the registered people have used Sephiroth. <laughs> and then the three with oh, zero. Min Min, Pyra, Mithra, and then Minecraft Steve. Seriously, people don't like to are using Steve. That's my cue. I guess it's because his move set is kind of. It's kind of hard to understand. Still rare in the game. I don't even understand him. Like, I didn't, why do you think I haven't even bought the entire like, DLC? Pack? Good point. I only bought Sora. <laughs> and above that is Violet, Ryu, then the Mii Fighters, <laughs> specifically Brawler and Gunner. <laughs> Terry, surprising. Because the other one shows Terry as one of the most popular characters in Smash Brothers. Then again, it looks like this is like a lot of them is from Japan for the Terry fans. Then you got Dark Pit, where he belongs in the gutter. What? No, he doesn't. Okay, don't you? Know. I'm not a fan of Dark Pit. Well, then that's your, just your opinion. Yeah, but it's true. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> Then you got Hero, Dragon Quest, Dr. Mario, Corrin, Ice Climbers, Kirby, Jigglypuff. Who should be dead last? Who should be dead last? Kirby? Man, man, Corrin. Okay. Or just Corrin in general. <laughs> no, no, female Corrin's over. <laughs> they have the same boost set. No, that they don't. Thing. No, I'm talking about like. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. Alright. And no, uh, actually, I think female Corrin is uh, I don't think anyone will argue that. Yeah, that's why I think she actually breaks above no points. <laughs> All right, so of the here we go, the top twelve characters in the yeah! Smash Brothers Ultimate tournaments: Rob, Lucina, Ness, Joker, Cloud, Fox, standard. Inkling, Zero Suit, Samus. Yeah, you can do it. Yep, Wolf yes. and Snake. I knew it would be on there. and number one is Pokemon Trainer. Uh, I'm not surprised about that. I mean, a lot of people were very excited for his return when he was showing the reveal. Yeah, because, like, how they got rid of all of that just for Charizard, it, it, it just didn't feel right. 
Oh yeah, and I mean like I actually don't know like what where is Smash Bros. Yeah, thanks for helping. Uh, I I think this. Put me this in is there. The highest it's ever gonna be. Yeah, I mean, but like, what's it like when Nintendo goes to their next console? Like, what are they gonna do actually? Like? It's gonna feel like a massive downgrade overall, I believe. <laughs> wow, I love how you. Because I don't think some characters are gonna return. Like Pichu, come on, he's only an ultimate because everyone is here. Oh, I thank you. We will not see him again. Oh man, I really wish. I hope he returns. I would be okay with that too. Because Wolf's move, like he, he actually is. Like, he does the whole clone fighter much better than, say, like, Ganondorf for He's a long time. He's not an echo time. fighter, though. But he has, like, he was based off of the Fox and Falco moveset. Yeah, but his moveset for all in this game is, like, different. It's more polished. Now, now, Krom, that's different. Krom, Krom, I would be okay with not showing up again. Yes. The only uh, Dr. Reason Mario he's in is also, Dr. Mario should just be a costume choice for Mario. I don't like know how why he's, I don't out. know why he got in Appreciate Smash it. like 4, like, you know, Wii U and 3DS. I don't know why he got in. My guess is... Like, why they brought him back, I don't get it. My only thesis is based on <laughs> Sakurai being a troll. I mean, it makes a lot of sense. Because Sakurai... Oh, oh, like, oh. He has to deal with Smash fans 24-7, of course he's gonna get a that we know of. He probably still has people asking like, So, what characters were you thinking of adding but didn't add? When, have you ever thought of adding James Bond in 64 because Goldeneye? He probably gets that all the fucking time and he's <laughs> fed up. I mean, that's the thing about like fans, like they're always, like, they're always gonna complain about something. Yeah, I know like that Hideko Kamiya. Of uh, platinum games. Let's win this already. If, last time I checked, Wait, we used like. Uh, no, no, that, that, that's uh, for Konami. I'm talking about oh. platinum games. Kamiya. Oh. He was famous for like. Listen, stop asking me stupid questions on his little Twitter, and if you dare ask him a stupid question or say something he doesn't want to hear, he announced that he blocked you and then he blocks you. Wait, why he. Wait, is that true or are you like. Yeah. Oh, wait, and then actually someone true. actually went up to him at a con someone actually went up to him at a convention asking him about how many people he's blocked. He actually opened up his account, looked at the list for how many people he's blocked, showed it off for five <laughs> seconds, and then just started laughing and then went to the next person in line. <laughs> wow. The at the, the time this video came out, I think it was like 2019, 2018, he had 17,000 blocks. You were talking for nothing. Wow, that's impressive. And if I recall, like, Platinum Games takes a long time developing games, so it makes sense why they're too busy blocking people on Twitter. <laughs> yeah, one, no, one, I wonder where all the development time is going. Blocking people on Twitter. Uh, now I'm thinking, what is the most, like, like, they're still in development hell for Bayonetta 3. No, yeah, Bayonetta 3 is supposed to come out this week here. Yeah, but I mean, like, we didn't see any information for the longest time that people were afraid that we'll never see it. Yeah. Like, it's taken, like, it's got announced in 2017 Game Awards, so it's gonna be taking roughly five years? Oh, yeah, yeah, here it is. It is showing it's gonna be released this year. Yeah, Probably right instead they delayed uh, Bre the sequel to Breath of the Wild 2 um, to be delayed to spring of 2023, though. Uh... Which, I mean, yeah. that makes sense, though, because they can't have... Those are two games that people have been looking forward to, so to release them both this year would be bad. Yeah, because, like, it's going to affect one of the game's sales. If, considering yeah. Zelda is more popular than Bayonetta worldwide... Yeah. It's understandable. It would... Like, I saw that happening. Like, I knew that they were going to like the game. Also, I'm still trying to beat Astral Chain, which, in my opinion, is a pretty neat little game that Platinum Games made for the Switch. Uh, I can't get into that Thank game. That's eh, understandable. There's a lot of games that I just want to get into or I just can't get into. Yeah, I'm looking at some of the other games. They made Mad World on the Wii? I did not know that. Remember that game? Uh, I heard about Mad World, but I... I don't. As expected. Uh, 
It was like one of those ambitious Wii titles, like No More Heroes. Oh, like Red Steel as well? Oh, yeah, Red Steel also. Like, this was, uh, the entire world was, like, black and white, like a comic book, but the blood is all red. Oh, that, oh, right, that's mad bro. Okay, now I remember this. Then Boy, they, they had so like many that. skills, you know. I think they probably- no, no, Sega published it. Platinum Games developed it. Oh, okay. I didn't think you'd be surprised. It, it, it's understandable. They, they look like the people that would publish that game. <laughs> they publish anything that has a name on it. What's this game called? Fuck you, Simulator. Sold! <laughs> what, what happened? Press X to fuck you. Fuck you! Wow! <laughs> Innovative. Like, seriously, they're making a new, they're making a new avatar. Like, I mean, considering... Well, I mean, considering that Legend of Korra game was not good. Then again, has there yeah, ever I'm been a good the actual... No, I'm talking about Avatar's oh, the Oh, the, the, the James Cameron Smurf Cat one. Yeah, which, why? <laughs> that game is, like, seriously... They're the getting is, ready like, for Avatar 2. Like, 2009? Yeah, and people have been waiting for number two. But then again, if I recall, <laughs> the script for the first Avatar, the Smurf Cat one, it the was all the, over. like, because the Navi aliens, they, they were blue like Smurfs and they had a lot of features like cats. But they're not like Smurf people. They were blue like a Smurf. But they're not Smurf people. I don't fucking care. <laughs> I'm going to call the Smurf cats because it's funny. <laughs> okay. No, so far we're doing good on taking everything <sighs> out. If we find a, do we, is it a route or just kill someone? Oh, uh, we have to kill someone, but I don't have anyone that can blow Oh boy. Well, trust me, I if I could enjoy walk, I would have been done with this map like a half hour ago. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Look at that Please dodge. Other Please dodge. Please dodge. Uh, yes. Star Fox Zero, developed by Platinum Games. Oh, oh yeah. What? Oh my god. So many people have games. Which I understand. All you had to do was make the motion controls optional. And not release it so late in the Switch's life, uh, we use life cycle. Cause... And also, like, make it not to say, hey, I'm a, a reboot of Star Fox 64, which was a yeah, reboot of we Star already... Fox 1. <laughs> we already had that thing with 3DS, the remake of Star Fox 64 3D. We didn't need to have more Star Fox 64 like this, after it, that. It's like, that's like the fourth time they've reached the story. Yeah, and 64 was the magnum opus. You didn't need to retell that story again. Like, 3 has made sense. Maybe you like a novelization or something. Fine, whatever, do that. <laughs> novelization. Yeah, have yeah. a freaking George R. R. Martin or whatever his name is. He ain't writing Game of Thrones anymore. Sword of Ice and Fire, whatever the fuck he calls that world. He can write that novel. Are you talking about, like, Elden Ring, the recent, like, uh, release of the game? Yeah, he did Elden Ring, I recall. Yeah, he did. And from what I hear, Elden Ring is a very good game. I have yeah. yet to play it because uh, I'm well, saving up money. Well, you don't have a P well, you don't have a, um, uh, a good PC or an uh, Xbox. My uh... PC is pretty good. Uh, I, I had it updated recently. Oh, I'm sure it will. I mean, it plays... What games do I have on my Steam recently? <laughs> Soul Calibur 6, wow, that that's a Super Robot Wars 3, a bunch of Total War games, those can take up a lot right, of by the way, Crusader Kings 3 recently came to Xbox One. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, is it Kings free to play? Oh. Uh, yes, actually, I think it is. Okay. Well, there you go. I mean, oh, I what's play this? Free. I know that. PS3 emulator. Hmm, I think I could play PS3 games on it. Why would you... Oh my god, the PS3, Jesus Christ. Yeah, people for the longest time joked that it had no games. In the long term, I believe they're right. But then again, there's like those multi plat games. Might as well, because like the Xbox 360 emulators, I could never find a good one. Uh, I don't think there is a good one, because they have yet to actually make it. Exactly. Oh, let's see. Oh, my. So far, so good on Ferdinand. He's not dying. Yeah, I think I'm actually going to do some of this as well. Oh, well, let's hope not. Uh, I hope not because I really do not want to be playing this game. Alright, I'm going to have a hard time. Okay, thank you. Ah! Oh! Failure is not an option. Ow. <laughs> Keep it up. Keep it up. Okay. 
Okay, so far so good. And let's see. Uh, if I go here, he's gonna be able to attack me. Oh, just an archer. Okay. Oh wait. Uh, yeah. I think that's an archer. And let's dance for some base. Okay, I think we actually might be safe here. Oh uh, wait, never mind. That's not good. Uh, what if I go here? Okay, if I go there, that's fine, but I'm gonna have to... Okay, so be Maz... mindful. Look here, and let's see. What do I have for... Yeah. Oh, do I not have a combo action? Okay, I can grab one for the combo. Uh, I don't know. I heard that's not a good weapon. Eh, I don't know. That's probably not. Someone... Someone... I, re I remember someone saying that it wasn't a good weapon, so that's why I just shouldn't be carrying it anymore. Alright, and I can actually just move over here with some bang. Alright. Okay, what? Oh, I forgot about constant. Uh, what about- can I- no, okay, I can't move that. Alright. Here we go, let's see. I think we're fine, I think we're- oh, oh my god, I didn't see that. Uh, wow, the one time an armor knight is inconspicuous. It reminds me of that one- Fucking idiot in a uh, Fire Emblem Awakening, whose whole gimmick is no one can find him. Uh, Kellen. Oh, that's his name. I just called him Retard. <laughs> <laughs> Ow. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. I'm, I'm sure people say that really when this... they just randomly get attacked by him. Like, ow! What? What hit me? Nothing, Nothing here. To see, when you try to concentrate thinking about him, you see him phase in and out of existence. <laughs> I love his endings. Like, no matter who he gets married to, it they say his ending is always the same. His name, his, her husband's name, has been lost to existence. <laughs> she had 18 his... children. None of them. Well, we don't remember the name of the Victory dad. Is a short... <laughs> but then, if you have you him alone, be the ending is he just walks away to the mountains to be a hermit, and then I it's like overboard. some of the retainers go, "Hey, where'd he go?" Wait, is that He's remembered. Just I think it? that's how it went. Just to be sure, I am going to check. Because if I recall, like people would reclass him to be a thief. Oh yeah, th yeah, he can become a thief. I know that. Sweet of you. Oh no, that's not true. Uh... Now, now I'm curious. Is this? No, he is not in fire emblem heroes yet you think he would be considering uh, how many other people are in uh mm, i don't think he would be a good like hero actually i think maybe that's why he's not in the game actually because he's not a hero oh the freaking merlinus is in. yeah i know <laughs> a merchant gets in but not oh god <laughs> oh while we're at it that freaking gale like the one when they first did that Hole and he was dead last from Thracia end. Yeah. Or where was he? Glade. Glade. Uh, I have to check that. Okay, here it is. After the war was over, Kellum departed at least for a long journey. Of course, it took Krom and the others several years to notice his absence. <laughs> he does get remembered. <laughs> <laughs> my gosh, you gotta, I, I would hate to be. As you wish. I can't wait to go back and watch Stan post and be like, he does remember. <laughs> oh, that's right. The Road to Ruin was another good when we did something like that. We were joking about how I will get the, the one guy that we can't say or else someone threatened to take down your videos was in the back the corner watching the fight before heroes all talking. And then all of a sudden they walk this up to no the other spot and this are right for you. Right there. You're in good form. Giving us all of that. That was great. Wait, wait, what? Wait, 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 what are you talking about? Uh, you know, would be ending to Road Put to Ruin. Yeah. We were joking about how the four main characters were all together yeah. in this little cutscene, and then me and Zev were making jokes of a certain general it. character that we couldn't talk Joe about. Rise, you uh, can, yeah. Because, uh, like, you know, bad, apparently someone tried to take down your channel focused. over our jokes of him. Yes. I think it's silly, but either way. Oh, uh, because it's was in the. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I okay. don't know. I, I, the less I learn about this guy, the better. Um, 
was in the corner, like in the back, watching them. And then they moved to a different prepare. spot of the map where they show the overview, and there's his sprite, like basically watching. It. <laughs> we're like, he was what? Like we're pointing, like that one scene in uh, Back to the Future where Marty McFly is pointing at the TV. Hey, I've seen <laughs> something I like that. No hey, I've seen. This. He did Let's do try. it. All right, but I checked Glade. He is not a heavy hero. Oh, yet. oh no, God. Oh, yeah, they recently had a Grisha banner where August got in. Oh, good for him, I guess. Uh, let's see. Marie no. They also put in Galzus. Oh. Galzus? That makes sense. And let's see. Who was also the other character? Uh, oh, yeah. Karen got in. I appreciate it. The one character that you left behind. She you know, actually this? got it. I am so pissed. I literally just closed the video after saying that. I can't even watch the rest of it. And like the next character could have been like your favorite character ever, but it's like no, I don't care. As you wish. Did Gals have a personal weapon? I'm pretty sure because I can't remember. That. I don't think he did. I just know he was like maxed out stats. Okay. All right, I'm looking at some of these heroes. Let's see. I should just. You should just what? I'm gonna have to type it in differently in the search bars because I have no idea who are in this game. I will get oh my uh, gosh, there are me. so many people. Yeah, there's a lot of people in the heroes now. Oh, that's right. There's a cow lady in it now. Oh yeah, Ash. Put me in there. I don't know why, but when, but during the month of December, so many characters that like, go by the name of Ash that in games I was playing came out for some reason. I don't know why. Probably for the best, we know nothing else. Let's see. All right, here we go. The... Oh my God, the got violent in the guy who was like a mean, like the original mean character Fire Emblem because of how generic he looked. They got all the, um, uh, the coyotes. Oh. So yeah, I remember the FC Hack focused. community originally just called it them Star Wolf or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, they got the, yeah, yeah. the entire, um, uh, Wolf Guardian. Oh, gosh. I'm on it. Oh, man, there's some, uh, Oh, the one NPC character, Aramia from FE12, who was just basically possessed or something by a like, person. Yeah, like Aramia. Jesus. Jesus, and apparently. Yeah, I know. That's just weird. All right, I now FE2. Yeah, good character selection. So far, so good. My gosh, the act there. He actually looks like he could be more important the there sun. than he was in FE2. Because I, the game basically tells you, hey, see this guy? Yeah, his younger sister is gonna be better. So just heads up. And well, they were right. Yeah. All right, now Fe4. Wow. Wow. The, wow, the picture of August looks pretty accurate to how I. Oh, what the fuck? Forgive me, everyone. My bounty is here. But, oh man, there's a lot of. Uh, I did not expect so many selections for Marita. She wasn't even that big of a character. Yeah, and yet she has two versions of her. Oh my gosh, Kemp. Like the, the, the asshole archetype. Kemp is in. He's in. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Dethorva and Anand, who are just basically NPCs that you can do nothing about, are in the Yeah, I don't know why they're in. Show me more. Uh, Ernest is in though, which I mean, I'm yeah, well, that. that that makes sense. Yeah, let's see. Ira, I yep. will Jomka, my Aze, man, Jomka, Azel, and uh, Lysgarden. Well done. Good. My gosh, I'm I would it. love to see more FE4 in the future, but you know, let's Stay take a look focused. at FE6. When it Chad is in, yeah, Percival's in. Good for him. Nope. Runya? Okay, good boss character. Hi, Green. My gosh. Gonzalez! Yeah. <laughs> I love how they drew Gonzalez. It's in the same art done by the same guy who drew on Arden. 
they know which artist to get for the right character. I love it. Diet does not look like how I would imagine he would be in FE Heroes, considering his sprite. But it is so pretty weird. badass, though, I guess. Yeah. I'll give that. See, Kath, the like one of the few characters that people refuse to recruit because of just the requirement. They just say fuck it. Yeah, she got in. Yeah, she did. Oh yeah, Fiora. That that was great. Like of all like uh, <laughs> Elamine. Uh, Elamine is in? The yeah, Saint Elamine actually of... got in. Yeah, she's a myth. Yeah, wow. that's true because she is actually a myth though. Like, the only footage I recall of Elamine in the FE series was that, like, one of those GameCube demo discs where when you select Fire Emblem, it would show her and it would have, like, some holy Gregorian chants. That's weird. Oh my gosh, Orson from FE8 is in. And yeah. he looks exactly how he looked when you killed him. Yeah. <laughs> I have no. Bowman Nimi. Come on, kill this fucker. To mere beasts. What Dusel is that? Cool. This is what a real man. Riev, I did not expect that. But this is not the end. Um, oh, Tom's in it. Also, out our mission. Yeah, I mentioned that earlier. But oh, oh, Renek, I I'm not surprised. It's, it's okay. No, Renek is in. Oh, Bertram when uh, from that big map. <laughs> in a path of radiance. Mm -hmm. Betrine, okay. Ashnard, all right. Tanith and Sigrun, didn't see that. Astrid, wow. Yeah. Altina, I... the freaking mythological character. Yeah, I Man. mean, she's a myth. They know what characters to put in as myths, actually. Ah. Of course, that Oliver. Hair. That was a great one. Yeah. And those eyes. Ashira. That okay. That makes you sense. Me of wow. Someone. Flavia and Basilio. I didn't expect them. Let's see. Oh wow. Muriel's relevant. The goddess. <laughs> oh, thank goodness. We beat the chapter. Oh yeah. See. Yeah. And they also oh, played Primo. Zary. Well, I'm happy for you. Uh, oh Your my gosh. The Priam guy. The creator, oh my. I never. It's no wonder she looks favorably upon you. <laughs> Just it was like, it was I'm a descendant Sarah's, of Ike. No Good for you. Yeah. And just how oh my god, this his new map to get him. Jesus Christ. It was the biggest map in in Awakening. Yeah, they made him like the best for us. Oh, Mustafa, the boss. Yeah. That's cool. That is cool. I like that. Now, uh, Fates. That is oh no my answer. Gosh. You must use your power for something greater the, the than yourself. Garen portrait me, is great. He's a smiling. And your students <laughs> yeah, are like oh, a like, or to divide and go to war with smile. you. <laughs> Grandpa's what would you really do? happy. In that scenario, uh, you decide to represent oh, both the world that just and reminds your me of Gilbert Gottfried again. Um, Who would you? Benny, the character that like Hey, I love Benny and Fates. Yeah, if I recall Professor, his original name in Japan was Ben Wa, wasn't it? I, Thanks. This must so. be a side I, effect I'm not, of I'm not checking the final book. Changes. Final. Okay. I can't just leave. Oh, I'll you check here. it another day. No, don't check the wake. You could try I, I said another day. Okay. Thank oh, a bunch of the I'd kid characters. Yeah. Arthur's portrait is one of the worst portraits. That artist never came back. Let's take a look at what world of the. I just like the, what it says here. World of Crest for three houses. You must remain. Oh my gosh, that Elfric, the freaking simp. Yeah, he's oh, yes. in. All the Ashen Wolves are in. Oh, that's good for them. Right. Oh, the there is Flame no Emperor. Oh my Those gosh. Who are trying yeah, to harm his voice you actually sounds away. like, you know, how it is in the actual game. Uh, it, the, the freaking how Tokyo lovely. Mirage Sessions? Be, yeah, I wish they're I could in. Hold on to or some of them are. Have stolen. That you and uh, of course, the most important one, Gatekeeper. End. Yeah, he's in. He, I, I mean, he won Choose Your Legend, so it's understandable. Your and then we got some of these, like, repeats, but of special the events. Taking a look. From the moment oh, you took hold of the like sword of the creator, I prayed um, that for some reason, we got, yeah. some, we got out of so this, um, for um, um, genealogy's special anniversary, we got, like, special versions of specific um, Gracia and uh, her usual characters. Are so much more than the light. Oh, there's a good drawing of Raven now. Wait, what? 
<sighs> yeah, for the uh, hell special Close thing. Oh uh, yeah. They, they made him look Sleep. better. Mm -hmm. Just it, finally. Longer. Now fully Arthur, but then again, nobody like uh, the I a lot of the face characters aren't really that special. Mm -hmm. Always. Now Always the Easter. My forever. gosh, the whole Easter thing. No, no one looks good in these Easter pictures. Now we no. got the bridal groom ones. Wait, Zealot. Oh my, from FE6. Yeah, wow. Jared got and in. Juno is there too. Wow. Mm -hmm. Part one. Saul. Oh White my gosh, clouds. the lecherous uh, priest Pegasus from FE6. Moon. Yeah. <laughs> Throne of knowledge. Uh, that, I think he was on a marriage banner, if I remember correctly. Oh yeah, it says here bridal grace. Banner. Yeah. The northern That's lands neat. are enveloped in a bitter Let's cold. Let's see what else we got. The frigid oh, winds there's, uh, are carried across the sea to the south of Adrestia. <laughs> He's got a little summer when hat tilted. White snow falls on kind of reminds me of that locket. sniper from the Lupin the looks Third, as with how that hat crowd. is. However, That's beneath cool. that snowy blanket are thrown. Uh, uh, oh yeah, the memory. summer refresh with that terrible Fiora voice actor. Uh, that, that, that was just a terrible performance. Uh. Let's see. You should be getting to the Thracia banner that I'm, t I'm trying to tell you about. Oh, cool. Dazla. If for Halloween. Let's see. Degensia. Wait, okay. you for, wait, did you pass it already? I think I did. It was showing like all the characters for Yugdul, but I'll check them out again. Uh, there is so There are so many characters. Oh, a pirate one where Ray, Daros. Please is, talk man, to me. Daros what are one's you pretty good drawing. What is the meaning yeah, of that? Yeah, Isala and Tabarna were also pirates. It's almost as, well. as though. Oh my gosh. Fika as a pirate. That's kind of neat. Yeah, that's her only appearance in this, this game moment, so far. I read Gerald. What? Oh. In it? Ninjas, ninjas, ninjas. Deserts. It, Raphael, alright. Zion of 12. I got Lewin, Larce, Julia, Leaf and Selif, and Nana. Yeah. I wanted to get Lewin so badly, but I couldn't. Yeah, because Lewin is a very important character and everything. He, he, he keeps all of the Yggdrasil story feeling. together. Mm -hmm. I did get him uh, Larce, though, which I am happy about. Yeah, Larce is a very broken character. Mm -hmm. I don't know why she is dressed and why she has an axe in that. Uh, wait, did Odo ever? Did the Crusader Odo ever wear an axe? Uh, no, I think it could just be a reference to how she had, like, say the love stat thing that goes on. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, she she recruits an axe yeah, user. Either Javier, Johan, or, or Yohalva. Yeah. <laughs> I personally go for the one that's so axe like foot because warrior bow stat, you know, bow usage, mm -hmm. more versatility compared to just an axe knight. But that's just me. Yeah. All right. So we're going to end this episode off with the fun with uh, some promotions. So let's see. I think our first up will be Fernand with, as the hero. Actually, no, we'll save him for last. <laughs> First up is Hubert as a warlock because I do not have another dark seal. You know? I've passed, have I? Yep, one hit point and one res, thank you. Okay. We need something like that. Let's see, next up, Casper needs to get one more level. Jesus Christ, dude. Uh, what about the Ashen Bulls? Uh, oh, nice. Okay, nice. Balthus can become the War Monk, finally. And finally. He can smite our enemies while praying for their sins or something. One extra dex, one extra res, one extra defense, and one more extra move. And he'll be able to heal and use unarmed combat. He's gonna look so cool to a monk. Yeah, I like what I see so far from that outfit. Was there yeah, ever any doubt? Yeah, it looks, it looks really like. Good. Yeah. It looks almost like a machine. Looks me. like he will be very nice and warm during the autumn months. Mm -hmm. And finally. Oh, wait, what? Oh, 
I gotta buy an advance. Yeah, okay, damn it. We'll be right back after this shopping trip. <laughs> First thing, all right, let's, take, let's pay a visit to the shop. All right, so we need some advance. You know, you could just go to the in-game Costco to get like a big bulk of advanced seals. <laughs> the Costco. I could. Yeah, but... I could imagine Anna open in Fire Emblem opening up a Fire Emblem style Costco, get a pack of twenty Master Seals. Yeah, but what? But I only need one. You never know when you get nineteen more units. You're right. Well, I mean, for three houses, you don't really need like twenty Master Seals. Or another example. <laughs> Look at this: three copies of the movie Time Cop, all for the price of one. <laughs> I'll just get one copy. I. Don't need three. Wait a second. I don't even want one copy of Time Cop. <laughs> All right. So let's get Fernand, the hero we need. Finally. Finally. I am Fernand von Hero. And let's see. He gets. A true noble never fails. Thank you for it. I really thank you for that one extra magic of us. That's just exactly what a hero means. You know, to oh, but I could take damage from magicians much better. Magicians. I don't care how no, you I... nobles pronounce these <laughs> words. <laughs> okay, good. I can't hear so silly voice anymore. That's good for me. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. We. Who'd have thought the best way to cure your schizophrenia? Was to literally kill them. <laughs> I mean, we don't they can't actually talk in your head if you just tap the heels of your feet together and say, "I don't believe in you. I don't believe in you." <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna do it for this episode. Join us next time. Bye. Alright, is it safe? No, hold up. Oh, sorry. <laughs>